Uh, and now we're keep gonna... just keep... Wait, no, I think this is the right the button here. Is this the right button? Okay, well, the things are, and, and, but well, I guess the next Plinket review. What? 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 Oh, okay. I, oh it's, I, I think we're, I think Did you it's, fix it's, it's, it's working now. Oh, yeah. great. Okay. Okay. Great. Woof. Woof. <laughs> Woof.com. <laughs> is that a website? It probably is. <laughs> They're just figuring out that we were messing with them. <laughs> Sorry, guys. We thought it was funny. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna turn on this stupid game. I, I bought this game for like less than a less than two bucks. Uh -huh. If it sucks, we can quit and do something else. Okay. It's called I Zombie. I Zombie. We're doing it. Oh my god. What is? I don't know. What is this game? <laughs> Do you know like I, I, I know very... I Frankenstein the video game? Do you know the premise? Can I use the joy? This looks like a joypad game. Is that an option? Nope. That is not an option. Guess what? Fuck you and your joypad. All right, you know that's fine. That's fine. I'm a proponent of mouse and keyboard, but move. All right, I am moving. I'm assuming I eat. Do you... Eat automatically. Okay, now he's a zombie. Okay. Oh, that was easy. Next level. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got an achievement for that. I, I <laughs> oh, there's buttons here. Attack. Oh, it tells the guys to attack and stop. Oh, and follow me. Isn't so that you're neat? The, you're the king of the zombies. Yes. Oh. That's not how this is, work. This is neat. Mindless. Oh my god, those guys have guns. That's true. I'm liking it so far. Sorry. What are you doing? Well, oh, I was just seeing if we have uh, audio. It's fine. Everything's fine. Shut up. Are the people complaining? <laughs> no, no, no. I was just double checking. All right. Okay. Oh, God. They turn around. Oh. What's the range? Be good things to know. Oh, they're asking if you can play Angry Birds next. Angry Birds is a good game. Shut up. <laughs> Oh. Angry Birds is like a like a million dollar industry now. Yeah, probably like a billion dollar industry. I don't even know. <laughs> yes. Kids love Angry Birds even though they've never played Angry Birds. It's well, they have cartoons now. Oh, is there cartoons? Yeah, I know there's like toys and. They have like part of like their apps and shit is like watching like regularly updated cartoons. We have a what the fuck coming up? We do. Right. Hold on. Ryerson. Ryerson oh, illustration. Oh. Thank you for subscribing. We very much appreciate it. Like Ned Ryerson. <laughs> ground hog. No, I'm dead! You know me, old needle nose Ned. <laughs> <laughs> I was shot in Woodstock, Illinois. My relatives there at the time. Oh. Uh oh. Okay, this is not as easy as it looks. Oh, Rich, you're gonna shame yourself. Why? I mean, you're losing an eye zombie. So? <laughs> Why is there shame in that? Oh, I don't know. Do you have something against? I, I mean. Ah! I'm, <laughs> I'm terrible! Help! Now, this is casual and pod racing. Oh, definitely. Yeah, yeah this is a casual game. That's fine. <laughs> oh, they were asking for a no death of a zombie. <laughs> that's funny because he's already dead. Oh, that is funny. I don't know if that's what they intended. It's probably it not. It might be. If it was, <laughs> then that's very clever. Oh, there's more guys down here. No, no. I, it's neat. I like it so far. Okay. It's it's you know it's a two dollar game. <laughs> Yes, that's exactly what it looks a, like. A different set of expectations. Yes! Like, 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 like. Oh, God. Oh, 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 you regenerate. Oh, I do? You, How? You did. Well, you're a zombie. So? Uh, Zombies don't regenerate, they just... They deteriorate. They deteriorate. Well, yeah. Oh, no. You're not gonna do this. Yeah. I predict, I predict you're gonna die. Oh, no! And still regenerate. That seems so cheap. Well, 
Didn't we just talk about how this was a two dollar game? <laughs> I, I guess. Oh no. No! Come on, Rich. Use your tactics. Think like a zombie. Think like a zombie. Well, then I would just run forward into the gunfire. <laughs> so I uh, technically, technically I am thinking like a zombie. Oh, I, I okay. guess zombies aren't supposed to think, so... They are mindless. Mm. Oh, there you go. Now you got two of them. To. Yeah, the Ocho knows. This probably is someone's first Game Maker game. And I'm sure it's. It looks a little cheap, but it's fine. But you know what? It looks cheap, and it is cheap. <laughs> <laughs> fine. <laughs> oh, you're right. Your new, Rich, this is gonna blow your new graphics card. You should turn down the quality. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Quality render settings, that's very funny. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Ah, I died. Rich died. I'm gonna go again. <laughs> I'm playing Isaac. Just for a little bit. A little bit. No, this it's... isn't worth dedicating too much time to. You don't think? Nah. Uh, Holmesy, I'm assuming Escape from the Black Lodge is a Twin Peaks related game? Is it an official game? Or is it just like a fan made thing? I've never heard of it. I made a lot of zombies. <laughs> I'm doing good. So the scientist is important. Oh, fuck! They have machine guns now. Oh, by the way, I'm gonna make a quick sales pitch for the official Red Letter Media uh, bottle openers. Oh, they're quality bottle openers. Quality bottle openers. They also double perfectly for screwing and unscrewing tripod head mounts. Oh, really? <laughs> okay. <laughs> they, I, uh, there was like a weird uh, tripod head mount on, on your chicken camera. And I didn't have my tool on me, and so it's just like, oh, well, well, it works perfectly. Well, there you go. It was the perfect flathead screwdriver. It's a multi-use tool, and that's why we got it. Absolutely. Specifically, so you could unscrew tripod heads. Mm -hmm. Did this game get too hard? It's already monotonous. <laughs> already. <laughs> Sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, oh, but Whiskey Chan asks a good question: Is will they open bottles? Uh, sometimes. Yeah. They, they kind of suck. When it comes to them. They're unreliable. <laughs> unreliable when opening bottles, but when <laughs> unscrewing and screwing on tripod head, tripod head mounts, 100%. Yeah. asking you to do stealth. <laughs> yeah. uh, people are saying the music's too loud. Oh my god. Is anything right with people? Nope. Never is. <laughs> leftover, uh, leftover beefcake is saying, yay, now FTL. <laughs> you know, it's How many times get... have you played that on the stream, though? Too many. Okay. Too many. It's, a it's actually, you know, we're getting there. We're getting to FTL? We're, we're to something else. Uh, yeah. Unless you can, well, you have to get the scientist. You've tried so hard. Eh. <laughs> I think I know how to do it. Mm -hmm. Is that all I have to do? I hope that's all I have to do. If I have to get the rest of these guys, that's not gonna happen. Now people are making jokes. Maybe they're joking about the music being too loud. I don't even know. That's this is the real problem. You people. You're as unreliable as our bottle openers. <laughs> <laughs> I don't 
need game audio, just your beautiful voices. Um, it looks like it's a little loud. Still? I turned it down. You know, you see the green bars. I... Uh, uh, for crying out loud. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. <laughs> Sorry. It's almost off. Okay. If that's too loud, well... It's far too loud. Perhaps they're saying it's too loud because they don't like the game. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know that I do either. This is... <laughs> this is a buck and a half I could have spent on a gumball. An yep. overpriced... <laughs> overpriced gumball. That was going to be my next question, is, is how expensive are your gumballs? <laughs> oh, you're doing it! You got them! Well, if you go to the nice part of town, yeah. and you get the good gumballs, sure. there is a noticeable difference. You're right. You did it, Rich. You beat the level. Yeah. At Atlas is dead. I think you're right. It's not too loud. It's just on. <laughs> Get some troops. Octo J. What? Are you, oh, are you talking about Daleks versus the Borg? No. Yeah, Daleks would be able to take out a Borg or two before they adapt. Jack is wrong. Eh. And it wasn't Daleks, it was Cybermen, Octo J. Get it right. Cybermen versus the Borg. Jay is playing on his phone rather than participating in this portion of the He's conversation. He's got important I'm tweets. conducting important business. He's doing important business. Don't do it! Don't do your business! Yes, here's the thing. Daleks would beat the Borg. So the Borg would beat Cybermen. Because Daleks have better weapons than Cybermen. <sighs> Cybermen are just unstoppable robot men. Um, yeah, yes! <laughs> what are Cybermen from? This is the Doctor Who. It's, okay. it's from I know Daleks are Doctor Who. Mm -hmm. da uh, Daleks have better weapons. So they Daleks could beat the Borg, Borg could beat Cybermen. Rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> Dalek, Cyberman, board. What is wrong with you? Uh, many things. Follow me, follow me. Follow, follow me, me, follow me, follow me. Follow me, follow me, follow me. Follow me, follow, 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 follow. He's follow. a talkative zombie. Follow, follow, now, he's stop. A now he's a confusing one. Stop, follow me, stop, stop. Attack, attack, stop, follow, attack, follow, stop, attack. <laughs> Do you think if you do that enough, eventually, like, your your guys will just leave? They just say, fuck it. Fuck this guy. <laughs> He's too indecisive. <laughs> You're right. Daleks can time travel so they could go back in time and kill the first Borg. And then the Doctor wouldn't stop them because technically they're doing good by killing the Borg. <sighs> And I like nerdy things, <laughs> but this is just yeah, I know. the sorry. worst. I just, you know, just, this is the worst. It's just Doctor Who is it's pretty nerdy. It's it's nerdier than most nerd things because it's British. It's okay. Ooh, Dick the Birthday Boy has a really important question. Who would win in a fight? The Mighty Robots. Of Battlestar Galactica or the gay robots of Star Wars. Which ones are the gay ones? Are, are we just talking about like C3PO? Because he's prissy? Yeah, I never, he never came across as gay. No, he's not gay. I mean, he's a robot. He's not anything. This is the thing. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry to spoil your fan fiction, Dick the Birthday Boy, <laughs> but robots, they don't fuck. Yeah. Except for Fuckbot. Except for Fuckbot. He, he fucks everything. Too. Yeah, absolutely. The, There's no emotional connection. The, the no. robots in Futurama fuck. Oh. Oh. They have robot babies somehow. One of these days I need to actually watch Futurama. <laughs> it's yes, never, I've never it's seen It's quality. An episode, really? It's That's quality. I hear it's good. You've never seen any episode? I've never seen a, a, a minute of it. That's shocking. Mm. It's consistently good. Oh, shit. 
Oh, Jay, they're calling you a robotist. A roboist. I'm not, I, I don't dislike robots. I just understand that they, they don't have the, the same uh, mentality or desires as humans. The they're, same urges. The same urges. The same sexual urges. They don't have those because they're robots. They're robosexuals. <laughs> robosexuals. Is what they're okay. saying. All right. Oh, Jude Law was a sex robot in AI and a sexy sex robot. A sex robot? Was he? Jude Law? I know he was in that movie, but he was just. A, what, what Don't you he... remember? He was a he was a, a pleasure bot. Oh really? Yeah. I don't think I saw. I've seen that since the theater. Oh. Saw it once, and I thought it was over, and then it kept going, uh -huh. and I wished it was over, and then it kept going, <laughs> and I said, "All right, well, uh -huh. I've seen that." Yep. And then I left the theater and haven't thought about it since. That Jude Law. Hmm. <laughs> Do you have a man crush on Jude Law? I, I have an everything crush on Jude Law. Okay. That's a good looking man. What's he done lately? I feel like I haven't seen Jude Law in a while. A good question. I feel like he was just in something. Or maybe I just watched AI. I don't know. <laughs> you watched AI every night. I, I watch it all the time. Like all the time. That's right. He, uh, he was in a Gigolo movie. Hello, movie? Some, he was just. With a, da, da, da. Uh, he was just in what? something. They're gonna tell me. Alright, I'm almost done with this game. <laughs> oh, that's right, he wasn't Grand, Grand Budapest Hotel. Yeah, oh, there you go. Listen, Turbo Jesus 5000, kind of a dumb question. Who would win in a fight, Han Solo or Indiana Jones? Han Solo has a laser gun. <laughs> Indiana who's, Jones has a regular gun, though. Who's cooler? Who's cooler? Oh. Indiana fucking Jones. Yes, I said it. What makes him cooler, though? That's a good I'm, question. I'm still debating this, so I don't know. But what, what would you say makes him cooler? The fedora. <laughs> the fedora? <laughs> yeah. yeah he's, he's kind of a badass. That's pretty, that's pretty, a, a pretty superficial reason. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. If not cooler, then he's the more fun character that I enjoy more. Okay. I would watch an Indiana Jones adventure sooner than I would watch a solo Han Indiana Solo adventure. Indiana Jones is more interested in in adventures. Yes. Han Solo is sort of like dragged along <laughs> against against his like it's not his first uh, priority. Sure, but Han Solo has had previous, you know, the time he had to dump his cargo because the Empire got too close. <laughs> oh, I'm sure, sure. I'm sure that was a great tale. Yeah. <laughs> <That> was a... <laughs> <laughs> you know, uh, I'm going to agree with you that Indiana Jones is a cooler character. Okay. Yeah, I think so. I don't know how to quantify that. It's just a gut thing. Sure. And sometimes that's all you need. Well, I, th I think... Indiana Jones has more of a drive. Yeah, he does. And so therefore, he has more of a character. Mm. Yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah. Who would shoot first, Indy or Han? Uh, they both shoot first. <laughs> that, that, that guy with the, the sword and raiders, he just shoots him. That's so great. <laughs> Greatest gag. Shit. Greatest gray gag. Indiana Jones sleeps with teenagers. No, they're in college. No, they're college age people. And he doesn't sleep with any of them. Right. They just all want him. They just all want him bad. Yeah. And can you blame them? <laughs> done already. Done. How many levels did you make it? I don't know, five, six. Oh, here's a good reason why Indiana Jones is cooler. He murders more people. <laughs> Uh, very true. <laughs> well, Han murders Greedo. Yes. He helps murder other people. But he he's not the, the, the direct cause of someone's death and nearly as much as Indiana Jones. He murders the the one TIE fighter for sure. Okay, you're 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 <laughs> Two. Yeah. I got two. You're grasping at straws with... Absolutely. I'm, I, well, I was trying to do the murder count. Okay. Uh, Indiana Jones murders Indiana Jones countless murders people. way more people. Absolutely. Countless people. I'm not... I'm sure someone has counted all the people that Indiana Jones has murdered. There's a murder count in the Plinket Review. Is there? Yeah. 
Neanderthal Jones in the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull Thinker review. I don't watch your stuff. <laughs> you should know that. <laughs> I've only heard passing comments of this Plinket review, which I'm sure is a good review. But... Yeah, there is a, a murder tally in that. So here's the thing. I really didn't remember that, and I was being a little facetious that some nerd had made an Indiana Jones murder count. <laughs> some nerd did. <laughs> it was reference. Yeah. Also, people, yeah, of course I've seen the reviews. That was me being joke, joke jack. You, I you just, just forgot about that portion of it. I forgot about that specific moment in the review. 